welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be doing a day in the life video i've just got ready today i'm going to be filming mixed in with some other bits and bobs i'm actually going to see a hypnotherapist later as well so i obviously won't be able to film in there um and i don't know if i'll feel like filming afterwards because you know you can feel like a little bit vulnerable afterwards but anyway just been getting ready just on my makeup filming face just been watching tasha and, oh my god so, so this room is my office room i hadn't been in this room since like last wednesday so i had to do like a big kind of sort out it's been really really crazy with packages and things like last week and obviously you know i get quite a lot of packages anyway but um yeah it's just been it's just been really crazy last week so i've been trying to sort out all my packages and stuff and i've got there's been so many new in things so like i might maybe i'll show you guys some of them later in the vlog and yeah i'll try not to make it long because i know you know i don't want to do like a really tedious like you know showing you through everything but uh, you know why not show you some new in things just in case you're wondering i because i haven't talked about beauty for ages as well so it'll be quite nice to talk about that what I want to show you guys though this morning is that I've got some new bits from Amazon and it's bits from their prime wardrobe so um I got two huge packages last week so I want to show you guys uh what I got from Amazon and like explain all of that as well so I'm burning Estee's um daisy candle it's so nice oh I love it I've got my coffee Oh, the only thing about not having dairy is that the milk separates from the the shot. Hey guys. Okay, so I've put you on a tripod because it's just a little bit easier because I'm going to be showing you bits. It's kind of like a haul, I guess. So I thought I'd put you on a tripod and I'll be able to like chat through everything a little bit quicker. Um, look at this. <laughs> look at these packages. So like I said, I've got some bits from Amazon, which I never usually think about for like shopping for clothes. I mean, I think before actually I've like found brands on there that I haven't been able to get otherwise. Like I remember I was looking for Jaden uh, Docs on there not long ago. Um, but this time I was able to properly look through and like look at all the brands that they do. So these items that I've got are from Prime Wardrobe, which is a new service, which is for Amazon Prime um, members. So it works really easily. It was my first time doing it actually. So you can choose from between, I think it's three to eight items of, I mean, it can be clothing, accessories, shoes. The items will be shipped to you in one to two days. Um, and they try and do it all in one package to like, you know, save packaging and try and make it easier. Up front as well, so you don't have to pay anything when you order. And then you have seven days to like try everything on um, and like see how it is or see if you want to keep it or not. And then you only have to pay for the items that you want to keep. Um, and then you have 30 days to return everything and then there's no added cost or anything to return the items and the items come in like resealable packaging and everything so it makes it really easy um, you know all the returns are prepaid and everything so I thought I'd let you guys know all of that I wanted to try out some items from the brands that they have on there some brands I know of some brands I haven't tried before and also I got indie a few bits as well so I think I'll show you my bits first ah oh my god do you know how long I've been looking for this this Calvin Klein jumper. Oh, I'm so excited. I couldn't find this anywhere. Oh, it's so nice, look. I hope you don't mind what I'm wearing at the moment, by the way. I'm just in like comfortable home day clothing. <laughs> I got this Calvin Klein jumper. I got it in a size medium because I wanted it to be a little bit oversized and like comfy. This looks pretty perfect. Yes. This is just how I wanted it to be. I'm really glad I got a size medium because small would have been too like, restrictive i got some levi's i got some jeans um but i got the 501 tapered jean waist 27 length 28 okay the jeans are a little bit small <laughs> and they they sit right on my hips which i don't really like like they're quite low so i might take these ones back but i mean the jeans themselves are really good like i you know levi's are really good jeans quality wise but, um, oh, they just don't feel right. <laughs> Leopard print. This is from Warehouse. They've got Warehouse on there. I've got a size 10. I like to go up a little bit in coats because I, I want to be able to layer underneath. Oh, I really like it. I really like the, I don't know, like the, the print. I then got another coat. I used to have a pink coat from ASOS, but after a while it kind of lost its shape. It's got like a satin pink lining. 
might I might send this one back I think it's the tone of pink yeah I'm not sure about this one it's a nice cut though but I think I prefer the leopard one I saw these trousers from Vera Moda kind of like really casual relaxed like tapered trousers for when I want to kind of look put together but I'm not being put together and lastly for me I got this jumper I don't know how I feel about it <laughs> off it looks nice on like on the model um so i'll try that on hey i'm not sure about this it doesn't feel very me so i'll probably send this one back i like the arms but i don't know i just i don't know <laughs> and then for indy i got two things <laughs> so i just got her some pajamas i got her some bell ones like, honestly i think this is the first like disney princess thing i've ever got her i don't um usually get her much of it yeah just some cute little pajamas i thought they would be nice always good to have pjs are always handy for kids then i saw these wellies from hatley oh my god i had to get her some wellies they look so cute and obviously because of the weather uh, at the moment oh they're so cute oh my god oh my god i'm so i really want these myself they're so cute so some little wellies from hatley um, I, she's not here right now, so I can't put them on her, but I will obviously when she gets home later. I got them in a size five. And they had loads and loads of choices as well. There was like te more than 10 or more. It's exciting working with Amazon because we use Amazon all the time. Honestly, like especially since having Indy, Amazon Prime has like been an absolute lifesaver. That's my little Amazon kind of haul segment. So I'll put all links and everything. Um, I will put down below in the description box. So it's a few hours later now and I've just filmed a video which went quite well but it's so dark outside it literally looks like it's midnight and now I have to leave because I need to get to my um, hypno session and I just got back from my hypnotherapy session it was good it was it was emotional <laughs> kind of and like hard but also good I feel a lot better so I was just making a cup of tea to like relax myself. So I've just put Indy to bed and I've come into the bathroom because as soon as I put her to bed, I always just want to come into the bathroom and like take all of my makeup off and um, just, you know, get all nice and fresh faced. So I was going to do just one day in the life, but I think I'm going to make it into two days because I'm feeling pretty like tired and kind of like, you know, I feel like I need to like recoup emotionally after my hypnotherapy session so you know i think i'm gonna carry this onto tomorrow as well I'll bring you guys along with me tomorrow um i hope you guys don't mind i'm just gonna try and kind of switch off a bit tonight and recharge i'll take my makeup off on camera because why not but i'm gonna sign off here and i'll see you guys in the morning the gym this morning i did a bit of a cardio session um, with a little bit of um, abs oh, and i always prefer doing it in the morning because it's just nice to like get it out of the way and it gets you in a nice mindset i thought i would show you guys some new in like packages and things i'm feeling like cutting my hair as well already you guys know i like change <laughs> like maybe to like here i don't know um okay i've got a package from drunk elephant I wanted to update you guys on like what I've been up to recently as well and like what I've been into. And um, I was watching um, Amy Vagabond, or Vagabond. Um, she's such a good YouTuber, like shout out to her. I really, really like her content. I'll link her down below. And she did a video on the law of attraction, which I've obviously, I've known about for a long time. I used to kind of put more energy into it and then I, I think just before having Indy actually, I kind of dropped it, I just forgot about it. And I've been in such a low place like for quite a while and 
I think just seeing her do that video reminded me of that. So I want to like thank her from afar. I then bought the book The Secret because I've never read it before and I'm reading it now. So yeah, it's making me feel a bit better actually about things. 2018 holiday kit. Ooh, look at this. There's loads of like mini, mini versions of their products as well. That's so cool. Thank you, Drunk Elephant. I really, really love, love their products. I really want to do like a, maybe soon I'll do a what I'm loving video. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like people aren't as into like the monthly favorites anymore. Or are you? Let me know. But anyway, I haven't done one for a while. So, but I've got a lot of things that I want to chat about. Look at these Christmassy bits from Quarterly. Christmas is coming. Magical light sparkles from the vines. This is such a good trio of products, honestly. I love all of these, they're amazing. Oh, so this is a body one. Ooh, the Vine Body Butter. And the, oh, hand and nail cream. I've not tried that before. Thank you, Cordily. Oh, and I got this quite a while ago and I've been meaning to share it for so long. Bathe, like, package. And it's from La Eva, book called Bathe, which it's like, the cover is like tiles. It's like indented, like proper tiles, which is really cool. How cute is this box? Look at that art. Complete art, that is. I really don't want to get rid of that box. That's such a pretty box. Um, and in here, there's three of their products. Ooh, and an Esper soothing bath oil. I'm so excited to have a bath. I've had lots of new bits in from Marc Jacobs as well, who is an amazing makeup brand. Look at this. Oh my God. <laughs> It's so pretty. I haven't wanted to open it because I wanted to show it to you guys like this. So this is going to take a while for me to like get through and test out. But let's see what this is. This is a lip product. Oh, it's gold. All over foil luminizer. Oh, look at that packaging. Oh my God. I always love their compacts as well because they're really big, like look, compared to my hand. Thank you, Marc Jacobs. Um, also from Laura Mercier, they've sent over a few bits recently. Um, I've got their new um, translucent loose setting powder, but it's a glow one. Oh, so okay, so it's more like a, a loose bronzer almost. Oh, I'll definitely be trying that out. And then they've sent their translucent setting powder, yes. I've wanted one of these for so long and I think I've like misplaced my other one that I had. So yeah, this is so, so well known from them. It's such a good product. Thank you, Laura Messier. Alessandra Steinher's Primark collection of skincare, which I'm so interested in. I haven't tried it out yet because again, I wanted to show you guys, but it came in this like purple duffel bag. I really, really like the packaging and they're super affordable as well. So this is the micellar cleansing gel sleeping face mask oil free gel hydrator oh super detox clay mousse face mask five pounds i've got this little package from tom ford look at that i've got bella river and z how nice are those colors this one's probably my most oh this middle one is probably my most wearable that's going on my desk and lastly, I've got some lip products from YSL, which are so, so gorgeous. So they're, I think they're called the Slim. They look like this. I really, really like the packaging. Look, cause they are like diamond shaped, matte as well, but really like very soft on the lips. So nice, so wearable as well. That's going on my desk as well, actually now. I think that's everything I want to show you guys. Um, I tried to make it as kind of like speedy as I could. So I thought I would just announce the winner for the giveaway that I did the other day on my channel. And they were totally randomly selected. And the winner is Beers Goes or Bees Bees Goes. I'll put your name here. So I'm going to message you. But yeah, thank you guys all so much for entering. And uh, do you know what? I'm going to do so many more of them. And maybe I'll do a lot more like over Vlogmas as well. I was going to make lunch. <laughs> But I've got so much to do today. I don't really have time to make like a proper, proper lunch today. So we've ordered a cheeky Nando. So while I wait for that to come, I, on my windowsill, I've got like my go-to daily makeup. When it's makeup I want to try out, that's new in. I add it in this basket. Um, but every now and then I need to do a bit of a detox. So I thought I'll do that with you guys and like show you what I'm gonna 
take out and like what I want to keep in my daily makeup basket. This is how it is at the moment. So I've got, this mirror is from John Lewis. I really like it, it's handy. This Le Mer powder, I've only used it, um, I think yesterday for the first time and I quite liked it. So I'm gonna keep it here. Um, this is an hourglass like palette, which is gorgeous. So I think I'm gonna keep that around because I really like using the, those highlights. Um, this is a NARS palette that I got really into recently for my eyes. Um, and I do still love that actually, so I'm gonna keep that around. But there's like not a proper place for them. Like, I don't know where to put palettes. So for now, I think I'll just like keep them there. Um, maybe I should get one of those organizers and I can stack them. Um, okay, now in my basket of joy. I really like this powder actually from Fenty, but my favorite is the Charlotte Tilbury one and it smashed recently and I'm very sad, so. This is stepping in for now, so I will keep that there. I'll just put the bits I'm keeping here for now um, and then put them back. This all-nighter spray, yes, definitely. I literally like use that every day. Um, I think I'll keep this around. Hourglass Veil Primer. No, I'm gonna put that back in my big drawers. Over here, behind the door is like my big makeup drawers where I keep all of my it's my highlight drawer i always i always lose what drawer i want yeah this is these are my drawers for all of my other bits like uh this is like concealers lip products etc nars foundation yes i'll keep that around for days where i want more coverage i love this concealer but i might actually put it in my big drawers because i right, that sounds funny because um I'm not really reaching for it as much right now. Uh, oh, this bronzer that I love. Yes, I will keep you. I like to have a moisturizer here as well because some mornings I like rush, um, I rush to my makeup and I haven't done my moisturizer yet. So I keep, I'm gonna keep that. I am going to actually switch up my, what? can you see how used that is? I've been using it all summer. I love this, but I'm gonna switch it up for the CC cream um, just to change it up. It's gonna stay, that's gonna go. Oh, I've got two precisely my brows, so I'm gonna put one in storage. Uh, eyeshadow base, no, big drawers. Uh, eyeliner, yes. Oh, I really like this, this by Terry Mascara. It's the Growth Booster Mascara. I really like that, so I'm gonna keep that around. I really like this as well. Actually, these two I like as a duo, so I'm gonna keep those. I got a Vega Lash uh, Lash Booster. Um, I'm gonna switch that out and put that in the big drawers because I've got a new one to try out actually, so I don't need this one right now. I'm gonna switch out the Radiance Primer. Love it, but I wanna switch it up. Oh God, lots of little things now. Hair bands. <laughs> Love this, this always stays. It's by Contour Powder by Kevin Aquan. Um, switch. I'm just gonna grab a few bits that I'm gonna take out. In you go. I've got two Glossier Boy Brows, so I don't need two. Okay, we've got liquid liner, backup brow pencil. Oh, I do love this. It's the By Terry Ombre Black Star pencil sharpener. Okay, that's looking a lot better. I'm just gonna put all these bits back in. Uh, now there's space for the palettes anyway. Yay! That's a lot better. This is from H&M Home, in case you wondered, this basket. They do so many cute bits like this. It was so cheap as well. From Nando's, I got Chicken Butterfly. And I usually get like the Macho Peas, just because it's something healthy. Oh, olives, yes. Oh, and I got the Sweet Potato Wedges. Does anyone else agree that the Nando's Sweet Potato Wedges are just too big? Why are they that big? Like, surely they can just make them a little bit smaller because they're so big that they end up getting a little bit soggy and, you know, like you pick it up and it goes all, it literally like just falls. <laughs> anyway, but you know, what can you do? I got them with the Perry Salt on this time. Mm. But you know what I mean? Like it, I love sweet potato, but it's so big. <laughs> Why, look. <laughs> Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
so I'm going to crack on with some editing now. I hope you guys liked this vlog and um, again I hope you like vlogs on this channel. I'm obviously still kind of seeing how it goes on this channel and if I think it might be better to switch it back to the other channel I will do. Also next week got some really exciting videos coming. You know I like to keep you guessing. <laughs> I like to mix up the kinds of videos that I do so yeah I hope you guys will like those. Uh, if you liked this video don't forget to give it a like, um, subscribe if you want to keep updated with my videos, you can follow me over on Instagram as well, um, it is Samantha Maria Official, I'll see you guys in the next one, bye!